Welcome back, FTC teams. This is um, part four of our Autonomous Exposed series. I'm Rashi, and we'll be working with Buforia today, which is an augmented reality software that allows us to read the VUMARC targets and determine the crypto key during Autonomous. We can use the robot controller phone camera to read the target, and you actually don't need any phone cameras that are better than the ZTE speeds, which are what we personally use. In this video, we'll cover the initialization and implementation of VUMARC tracking. So one of the great things about Blocky is that um, FTC has actually made a template for Vuforia. So when you create your op mode, make sure you go to the sample and get that template. Um, that's what I'm opening now. So the first thing we're going to look at is the initialization of Vuforia and the initialization of your code. So there are a couple of different parameters that we're going to look at. The first is the camera direction parameter. And um, this decides whether you're using the front or back camera on your phone. Then there's the use of extended tracking parameter, which allows the program to track even when the VMARC target is not visible. And um, the enable camera monitoring parameter, which allows camera and image tracking information to be displayed on your driver phone. Then there's the camera monitor feedback parameter, which has the most options. It has um, default, none, axis, teapot, and building. We're going to use the axis parameter, which uses x, y, and z values on a 3D coordinate plane. One of the things we'll be using is telemetry. This displays information to the driver station phone so that your drivers have information about the robot state. Telemetry is actually found in the utilities menu and the blocky interface. We're also going to create a new string variable called VUMARC scene to hold the crypto key value from the VUMARC to use later on in your program. This is the same information that we'll be displaying to the driver through telemetry. So create that variable and set it equal to an empty text field. Um, you can actually access all your variables through this drop down menu here. So I'm selecting a uh, VUMARC scene and then going to text and picking up an empty text field and just setting that equal to that in initialization. In the actual while loop of the program, we're going to start using our before your tracking. So locate the block that says uh, set VUMARC results to call Vuforia.track, trackable name, trackable name dot relic. We're going to leave that block as it is. Next, we're going to find the blocks that actually analyze the VUMARC target and returns the location of the crypto key. So we're going to find our variables that we made earlier, the VUMARC scene variable, and we're going to actually place it under the telemetry, not this telemetry, sorry, it's actually the next telemetry which you'll see me move it to. But we're setting the VUMARC target to a text field, which we're going to keep the location of the crypto key in. So in this if statement down here, we're actually determining which crypto key is determined by each VUMARC target. So we're storing that information in our VUMARC scene variable to use later on in your code to move your robot to that crypto key. So as you can see in your telemetry, it says um, relic target go for the left goal or go for the center goal. And so we're storing left and center in our VUMARC scene targets, and then it'll be right. And then um, at the end of your telemetry, there's an elf state, uh, else, else statement here where you cannot determine what the VUMARC is, so we're just going to store unknown here. There's also one more else statement at the end of this, which is actually when you don't see any VUMARC target. So there we're going to store none because you're not getting any data back. You can use those variables later on in your autonomous code so that you can actually go to those different targets. So now all that's left is to test out your program and integrate it into the rest of your autonomous code. <laughs> 